crucial dimensions were, were kept the same, the bolt patterns, um, where the uh, where the springs will come up into into the actual base plate itself. Yeah, we also counted some into the base a little so that the yoke would sit down in it and not have it as much pressure as it would have if we had counterboard there as well to allow um, us to bolt it together and that be flush because the bottom of it will sit against the, uh, the bottom of the bolt itself. So. Alright, all the parts were designed in SolidWorks and then uh, the tool paths were generated in SurfCam uh, and that's where we got our, our G-code. Uh, parts were machined via the CNC lathe which is where we did the back half of the wheels, and then um, and then a CNC mill to do the rest of those, and then uh, the truck pieces. Um, they we did have an original design, but we did make alterations, um, especially on the truck, so that uh, it'd be easier production. And uh, we decided to machine everything rather than trying to cast. I figured that'd be a little too difficult for us. 